Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we're going to be talking about if it is a good idea to start mining BTT or BitTorrent coin. So before we get into the video today, I do want to make sure to ask you to hit the like button to help out the YouTube algorithm in recommending this video for more people so more people can learn about BTT, cryptocurrency, and what's going on in the cryptocurrency world. So let's get into the video today. So we're going to first start off by looking at the coin market cap and see here that Bitcoin is still down from where it was, but it's actually up on the day. So that's nice to see here. Uh, some other popular coins, Cardano's $1.58, Dogecoin $0.30, cents, XRP's $93, uh, Uniswap $25.53. But uh, if we search up BitTurrent coin, BTT here, you can see that it is still 0.003629 cents, which is down quite a bit from when I originally made my first video about it about a month ago, saying BitTurrent could be the next Dogecoin. Now, I still think that BitTurrent could very well be the next Dogecoin. They do have quite a bit of coins in circulating supply, but it is capped at a maximum supply. Now, BitTurrent, there's so many more out there currently, but I do believe that a lot of the development team has them locked down. But overall, I think it still has a lot of potential to go up, and it did hit an all-time high back in the beginning of April at just over a penny. Uh, so it has fallen quite a bit, and if it was to just go back up to that one penny range, there would still be really, really, really good profits to be had if you were to purchase or mine them at this price. So I'm going to be kind of talking about uh, my decision to switch to mining BTT for the last roughly month and if I think it's been good or not and if I will continue or not. So mining BitTorrent, I have switched over and I've been mining. So I've been using Unminable here to mine BTT for the last little bit, which is really cool to... Um, use because it actually supports four different algorithms for mining BTT. Uh, I personally chose to use the ETH hash mining algorithm and even though one of my mining rigs has been having some issues here, it is still mining with about a, uh, 220 mega hashes or 220 mega hashes of mining speed and you can see that I have earned just under 100,000, it's rounded up here, BTT within the, about the last month. Now. That's a lot of BTT, especially if it was going to uh, go up at all in price. Uh, the mining rigs that I have, I've, I was pretty lucky to be able to mine about 100,000 of them in a month, uh, which puts me in a good position if they do start to go up in value again. Now, I still think there is a lot of potential for this coin, like I said, for it to go up in value, but we'd have to wait and see what happens with that. But overall, I think it was a pretty good decision to mine, and I would say if you're looking for a coin to mine and get a bunch of, and really if you're looking for a little bit more risk, you don't mind maybe taking a loss or you know maybe not earning as much as if you were mining Ethereum, BTT I think is a great option because you mine it for a little while, you get a bunch of them, and if it does go up in value, you're going to have a lot more return than if you were mining Ethereum that whole time. You know. With the mining rig that I have, I was earning about 0.1 Ethereum every week and a half to two weeks. Ethereum would have to go up 100% or uh, 100 times for it to, uh, you know, make as much money as if BTT was to go up just, you know, once a little bit, really, just double and, you know, double itself once. You know, Ethereum could double itself once and... Yeah, I've made some good money, but not nearly as much as if I had been mining BTT. So I still think that if you're looking to get into mining and have a GPU or a gaming rig, something like that, and want to mine and get some coins to hold in hopes that they go up like crazy, I think BitTurn is a really good project. They've got a lot of different ideas and ways that they are planning to move their project towards here in the future, but we will have to wait and see what happens. I think if we do get an altcoin season, starting here in the next month or two throughout the summer and rest of 2021. BitTurn, I think, could easily hit a penny again and maybe even 5 to 10 cents. Now, of course, that's way down the line, but we'll have to wait and see. So overall, if you are looking to start mining BTT, I think it's a good decision. Even if you just mine it for a week or two or a month just to get some and then switch back to a more profitable coin. But last I did the calculations, BitTurn is still profitable to mine on your computer if you're mining with ETH hash and you would be profitable mining Ethereum. You're just losing out on about a dollar to two dollars a day. So 
check out the link in the description below for the unminable pool you will uh, get an additional point uh, 25% taken off the fee that you have to pay if you use my link down below. So if you're thinking of mining, definitely use that and get that uh, little bit of savings for you. And uh, if you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't leave a dislike, let me know why you didn't like it down in the comments below. And if you have any questions or comments about this or anything else related to cryptocurrency, feel free to leave a comment down below or check out the Discord at the link in the description below. Please like, share, and subscribe to my Bitcoin Tips YouTube channel to learn more about spending, collecting, earning, and investing different types of cryptocurrencies. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.